Good day viewers and thanks for tuning into Polymer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. You are watching the Petrochemical Market Synopsis with me, Vaibhavi Pathare. It's Friday, November 11th. Let's start with energy news. Crude oil prices gained on Thursday on the back of a decline in the value of the US dollar. Brent crude prices rose by $1.02 settling at $93.67 per barrel, while WTI futures increased by $0.64 cents, settling at $86.47 per barrel. On Thursday, open spec NAFTA prices dropped by $6 US dollars per metric ton at $6.96 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. On Thursday in Asia, Ethylene prices quoted steady while propylene prices displayed a mixed undertone. This week, PS domestic prices were assessed sharply lower in the United States owing to reports of ample product availability in the local markets and bearish cues from the Asian region. Domestic rail car delivered GPPS prices were assessed at 116 to 117 cents per LV levels, a steep fall by 7 cents per LV. HIPA prices were assessed at 123.50 to 124 cents per LB levels, a sharp drop by 9 cents per LB. Before we move on to the weekly market updates for PP and PVC in Europe and USA for today, please do click on the bell icon to subscribe to our free news channel. And if you like today's video, please remember to like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you this free informative news service on a daily basis. Back to the weekly market updates for PP and PVC in Europe and USA. PP in Europe, this week PP block copolymer prices were assessed lower in Europe. PVC in Europe, this week PVC prices down adjusted in Europe. PP in USA, this week PP export prices were assessed stable in the United States. PVC in USA, this week PVC export prices declined in the United States. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video on Monday to know more. This is Polymer Update with me, Vaibhavi Pathare from Mumbai. Many thanks for watching.